a few days ago I posted a video with some robots marching around in front of some large television, television screens. I uh, made that video a few years ago back when I was still using 3D Studio Max. I now use Blender 3D, so I decided uh, to recreate those robots. I did that and uh, rigged it up and animated it. Uh, I posted a video of the animation earlier today. Now I'm posting, I recreated the robot again uh, quickly now just to have a video, a speed render, rendering of me making it. Actual time making uh, what I'm doing in this video was uh, about 14 minutes. I have it sped up to 400 times the speed, or I'm sorry, 400% the speed, four times the speed. And uh, so it's, but the actual time it actually took me was about 14 minutes to see what you're looking at right now. And in the description, or the doobly-doo, as Jordan calls it, um, in the doobly-doo will be a link to uh, the Blender file uh, with the model rigged with a walking animation. Uh, I'm releasing this under the Creative Commons license, non-commercial, share and share alike, so you can modify it and use it and share it. Uh, I hope that if you uh, do create something with it, you uh, post it as a video response here. And um, I'm not the best at rigging models, so although it's rigged, it probably could have been rig rigged better if someone out there is good at rigging and wants to uh, re-rig it properly and then share it with us, that would be great. Um, but I just wanted to share, show you how I made this, basically in a quick uh, little video here. And uh, I hope that you enjoy my videos, and enjoy the stuff I share with you guys, and I hope that uh, you guys, once again, uh, when you make something creative, I hope that you share it with us. If it's something visual, make a video and post it as a video response to one of my videos. So thanks for watching. Visit filmsbychris.com. And I hope that you have a great day.